We've left off here in part 12, watching a beautiful sunset go down over the Murray River there in Manham, South Australia. I tell you, what a beautiful place it was. But anyway, it was time to hit the road again. Adelaide bound today with a destination of Victor Harbour at the end of the day. It's only early. Oh, well, it's nine o'clock, actually. It's a pretty quiet little town of a Monday, isn't it, babe? Is. It's 28. Oh, yeah, that's right. It is too, isn't it? We're half yeah. hour behind here. Yeah. You're exactly right, babe. <laughs> this is Manham. And we're leaving Manham, aren't we, sweetie? We are. Oh, that's the first time we've been to Manham. That is the first time, isn't it? Yep. It's a pretty little place. It's a disappointment, though. No cruise. No. Nah. They're all over in Morgan, weren't they, sweetie? Yep. Not to worry. We had fun anyway with our river views. Yeah, and our drinking. Always have fun with our drinking, don't we? In a different town that we've never been to. <laughs> Such a relaxing little town, this, isn't it? Yeah. I'm going it was that time of day again. Time to find some fuel for the bikes. They won't go far without it. And we were up. Adelaide band. <laughs> Well, we're rolling to Adelaide, down through Adelaide Hills, from Manham, aren't we, my darling? We are, yes. And we're going to the Harley shop there, Harley Heaven first, we think, and then Bike Works, I think it's called, isn't it? Yeah, Bike Works. Yeah, then we're going to make our way up through to Victor Harbour, up around the Fluro Peninsula. I think I've said that right. And that will be where our journey ends today in Victor Harbour, I think. Will it not? It will, yes. Anyone anyway, think we're in Queensland with these tunnels? Yeah. Wouldn't you? Well, that's a little different. It's like the Queensland tunnels. Yeah. And up past the Gold Coast and up through to Brisbane. I suppose you'll get an off on the sound of your bike all the way through there, yeah. wouldn't you? Yeah, I thought yeah, so. Yeah, Fucking Harley really riders. Pretty neat. <laughs> the rumble. Yeah. Well, look at this. We haven't been in traffic for days, how, uh, weeks, have we? <laughs> We've had all the back roads and now we're back in traffic. Gotta love it, don't you, eh? <laughs> yeah, well, we don't like the traffic much, but you got to put up with these things sometimes when you want to go to different places, don't you? It is what it is. And you don't know the area too well so you rely on the GPS old Henry so we're not too far we're about six k's away from the first Harley shop we want to go to and have a look at because we've never been to it before so we thought well we're coming through this way we might as well might not we babe as well yeah we have a bit of a bow peak here is this the Harley shop my boots came from oh um yeah, I think it might have been Harley Heaven, wasn't it Adelaide? I think it was. I'm not sure now, babe. They have a lot of specials. Yeah, ooh, oh, someone's keen, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> I usually see them online, but now I'll be seeing them yeah, in person. Yeah, jeez. It's more exciting. Yeah, someone's keen. Here it is, right here. Aha, uh -huh. we found it. Yep. So, where's the Harley Davidson signs? Oh, they're further down, aren't they? Oh. You'll have to guide me, because they're very small. Swing on it. Swing on Swing on it. You're way a long way from me. You're three bikes away from me. I don't care. As long as I'm in some sort of lines. Yeah, you're going across them. Straighten, straighten, straighten. <laughs> you, know, you made go oh, crooked again. Hell. You're all right I'm there. hopeless. Good fucking no. We made our way into Harley Heaven in Adelaide, greeted by a plethora of bikes. I think Kim rather took a fancy to this trike here. Had a bit of a wander around and there was a bike that caught me eye, a nice looking sport glide. A bigger windscreen go on them? You can get um, a bigger windscreen, yes, so you can get a taller. Oh. Well that's already set up for the two-point yeah, backrest right. too, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Which is good. Yes, that's right, we'll swamp by a salesman. He came over to show us a few things about the Sport Glide. I've never seen Kim move so fast. She spotted markdown racks, a heap of clothing on there. Lucky I got out without it. But there was another dull moment. She spotted shoes. Well, bugger me dad, how many boots can a person wear at once? She just brought a pair online from this store. 
so we just went in too. Are we heaven? Here. Mm -hmm. Franklin Street in Adelaide. Great little place it was too. The bloody, bloody Harley bikes are cheaper over here, aren't yeah. they, no? Anyway, we're going to hop back on the bikes. Well, not to get one over. And um, we're going to head to the next Harley dealership, aren't we, both? Yeah. Which is Bike Works. Bike Works. See you guys. So we're on the way to the next Harley shop, aren't we, my dear? We are. It is still about four kilometres away at a Melrose Park. And she's definitely warming up here. It's gone up to 29 now. Oh. Oh, she goes. <laughs> I've got all the vents open on my jacket. Yeah. Yeah, she's done a warm up, babe. Okay, so we're at Harley Davidson a Bike Works, aren't we, my darling? Adelaide Bike Works is only six and a half kilometres from Harley Heaven. Yeah. This is it right here. And this is Kimmy here. This is Kimmy, Kimmy, Kimmy. We're going to go in here and have a good look. Made our way in here to have a look around. Come across a 2019 run-out model clearance board. Great prices on here. Some absolutely great bargains to be had there if you had the money. You made it too. There was a great assortment of bikes in here. I love this shop. Bike works in Adelaide, I think it might be better than Harley Heaven as far as I'm concerned. But anyway, Kim was on the boots again. I really don't know why she's got to look at them all the time. Look at this. When you buy me one for Christmas, I want the red one. The red one. Red goes fast. And what's it called? Sport a, a Sport Glide. Glide. Right. Okay, Rusty was just checking out bikes there. They've got some good deals in there. Haven't they, babe? Oh, yeah. Sport for choice over this way. Fucking hell, yeah. You build up a very big appetite when you go around looking at motorcycles. We did go to two stores, you know, wore ourselves out. Oh, they've all taken all under the shade parking. Yeah. Here, there's one to your left. Yep, I can see that. I don't know if you'll get in there though, backing it. <laughs> of course I will. <laughs> Being a smarter. Now, if I go all the way back, you won't have to come all the way back, Bob. Keep coming. Fuck it, I'm well out of your way here, babe. No, you're too close to that car. You're too close to the car. The reverse camera's not working. All right, now straight back at that. Keep coming. That will do you. Whoop, 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 that'll do you. Okay, we just had a Macca's breaking. First time for, I don't know, a week, wouldn't it, babe? A week? Probably be a week, wouldn't it? How did, how did we go about it? It was quite easy, actually, Since because we've been up and having other meals and that, haven't we? Since we left Nats, I think. Mm. It's a lot cheaper sometimes. There's a lot more fattening, though, isn't it, babe? Oh, not if you have a toasty. A toasty? Just as well, the slim, taut, terrific, rusty had a toasty. Yeah. You right? Yeah. We got nothing on the ground back there? Now, while we're going past Super Cheap and Auto Bun, do we need any more spare parts for the Harley? <laughs> <laughs> well, we are going to have to find other headlights somewhere. Uh, you reckon? Globe. <laughs> uh, just to keep us a spare -y. Spare one, yep. Never know. There's a bloke at the Harley shop, he said, where you from? I said, Tassie. Oh, he said, people normally go there to ride. <laughs> I said, yeah, nah, we've done that, mate. <laughs> Quite a few times. <laughs> I said, we've been coming over here for the last ten years. I said, we outgrew that. <laughs> Tassie you could do. You've done most of Tassie you have. <laughs> I knew I <laughs> have you? Why? Waiting, waiting for that. It took us a hell of a long time to get out of Adelaide. A hell of a lot of road works going on. But anyway, we headed off down towards Victor Harbour Way. And I tell you, stopping in all that traffic, it was well worth it. The scenes were absolutely stunning along this way. Beautiful mountains over there, were you? Absolutely glorious. We're on the way through to Normanville in South Australia, heading out towards Victor Harbour, aren't we, my darling? Yep, and I'm getting seasick. Why? This undulating road. These undulating roads? <laughs> yeah, they're a little bit up and down. It's probably why it's 90k through here. Yeah. Well, I've had to hold the strom back for a while. <laughs> it just wants to go, babe. It just wants to go. The, the workhorse? The workhorse. Isn't it beautiful though? Look at that. Grapes here. Of course, Mac 
McLaren Vale's just over to the left of us there. We would have went through that way if we had went that way to Victor Harbour, but we've gone a bit more of a scenic route, haven't we, darling? Yes, and the sea should be over on our right. It's over on our right there somewhere. Yeah. Oh, look at those views, guys. Wait a minute. Look at that. Beautiful. We're happy doing what we're doing and doing what we love. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. Isn't it? Don't soak. Oh, it's beautiful though. That is beautiful, yes. Coming in through there. It's all natural. Yeah. Yeah, it's natural with the fucking bitumen road up through the guts of it. <laughs> <laughs> What's this little town? I don't know. Is it that young killer? Oh, it could be. No, my Ponga. My, my Ponga. Ponga general store there, so I don't know. My Ponga Hall. What an absolutely beautiful way. We've been told to go this way before when we leave uh, Victor Harbour, but we've never we? been this Yeah, they've said go around Jarvis Bay Way and down through this way into Adelaide, like we're right. going away at the moment. Well, your friends in Adelaide told you that. My friends told me that at Victor Harbour, babe. Victor Harbour. Yes. My Victor Harbour friends. That's a funny name in town, this one, isn't it, babe? Yankalila or something. There it is, Yanka Lilla. Yes, you're exactly right, my darling. This little town is located 73 kilometres south of Adelaide, via the main south road on the Fluro Peninsula. It is 32 kilometres west of Victor Harbour, our final destination. Okay, welcome to Normanville, guys. We're going to pull over somewhere here. Oh, we might have a little drink, maybe. Oh, I don't know. We'll just see what's here, eh? Second Valley Kangaroo Island Ferry, babe. Town centre is to the right. Fluru Way. Yep, that's the way we've been travelling on, babe. That's the way we'll probably come back out, I reckon. But we're going to go around to the right here, guys, and just have a little boat dude. peek. As a surfer. A surfer, surfer dude. It's just a little seaside town. Normanville, known affectionately to locals as Normie, is a popular seaside resort town with long sandy beaches, good camping and other accommodation choices. Normanville was established by South Australia's first dentist, Robert Norman, in 1849. Beach. Turn left 100 metres. Well, we'll go down there and have a look at the beach, I guess. All right. OK, kiosk and cafe down there too. I can feel it getting cooler. We're getting yeah. near the beach. I smell fish and chips too. Oh, got a cold drink. We'll get a cold drink, she said. So, anyway, we'll go and find a park here somewhere. Won't we, my darling? Yeah, it looks full. Mm. Okay. Looks full. Here we are. Where at? Where we are? Normanville. Normanville. We are. We're going down here to get something to drink, aren't we? Okay, we've got our drink. We're going to have a look. We'll go for a walk around here, eh? And see what the go is. Look at this, guys. Is that beautiful or what? Hey? Oh, that coast goes all the way around there. Look at that. And we're going out that way soon. Beautiful, isn't it, babe? Are oh, the loud dogs on that beach? Oh, that's a bit rough, babe. Oh, no, that's rough. No rough. That's a bit rough. This is truly a very stunning area along the coastline here. I could imagine this would be very popular and very busy during the summer months. Are we not? Yeah. Well, we think we are. I think we kept saying Jarvis. Yeah, for some reason, I don't know why, but anyway. Should be right, won't it? We'll find it eventually. It is a beautiful place, isn't it? On the Fluro Way. The Fluro Peninsula. Funnily enough, it's 
it's not spilt like fluoro. Nah. It's like a French pronunciation. Oh, we need that little. We need them French backpackers here to tell us how <laughs> yeah. how to pronounce it. Yeah. I think I'm pronouncing it right though. Fluoro. Fluoro. Yeah, yeah I don't know. Got to put a little spin on it. Yeah, so it's just a little spin. But a very nice area, guys. Anyone that hasn't been down this way, get your ass down here. And park them right beside those two nice little asses on the lawn. Yeah, well. I didn't even know if they had pants on. Yes, I did. I checked that out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what were you going to say? Go and put some pants on? I was going to fucking run if they didn't have any on there. I would have been even more trouble. <laughs> Never mind, guys. Uh, Things like that happen on the road. They do. What happens on the road stays on the road. Correct. I reckon she would be a bustling little town during summer, during yeah. the holidays. What do you reckon, babe? Yeah. It's beautiful, isn't it, guys? A very scenic way. Just like Kim just said, our own great little ocean road here. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Look at all these pines, all planted all the way along here. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful, isn't it? You guys will see it in a sec. And this, ah. Uh, and this is why we come this way. That's beautiful. Mmm. Nice. Better chuck her back a couple of cogs to let her hold herself down here. She's fairly steep. Yeah. It is pretty steep. Mm. Look at that, guys. That's beautiful. Mm. Very bloody pretty, isn't it? Tell you what, this Adelaide's got a lot to offer. Yeah. Ferry terminal and boat ramp, babe. This is to go to Kangaroo Island, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. This is the end of the world here. Yep. Kangaroo Island there. There's a lookout up there. Helicopter landing spot there. Oh, yeah. Let's go over here for a minute. Timed parking area. Fines will apply, babe. Mmm. Cape Jarvis has a petrol station, a general store and a small community, a lighthouse and a wind farm, but primarily it is a terminal for the main car and passenger ferry across to Kangaroo Island. It is located 107 kilometres south of Adelaide on the southern tip of the Fluro Peninsula. Yeah, we've got to go all the way back out this way. Yeah. Oh, really? Hold down that windy bit. I guess so. One way in, one way out. Yeah. Well, isn't that a nice view, eh? That would be Granite Island out there, it is. Oh, we've been there. Yes. Granite so Island. We're coming down into Victor Harbour at the moment. Victor Harbour is a picturesque seaside town on the coast of South Australia's Fluro Peninsula, only 80 kilometres away from Adelaide. And of course, when we get into town, we have to find a motel. So, a quick ride around through the streets of Victor Harbour, sightseeing as well, we'll look for a motel to stay at to rest our weary heads for the night. Victor Harbour, in our opinion, is absolutely stunningly beautiful. A great little town. Victor Harbour has a population of about 15,500 people. So with that amount of people, I think we should have a fair bit of accommodation to choose from. Rusty's just reminiscing about the alcohol he's drank in this town. Well, old Rusty don't see a problem with that at all. So we decided on the Comfort Inn, just over the back of the main street. Nice little place, this. And he's put me in the shade. Woohoo! Reads his kind. I reckon he's thinking he's in trouble for some reason. Oh, the girls that he was perving on. Got him worried. Hey, look, they've got a 24 hour check in. So you just put your credit card in, I guess. Collect your keys below. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Where is he? My darling's in here waiting for me. Oh, 
it's big enough room. I thought I'd lost you. Nestled on a wide, sandy arc of Encounter Bay, Victor Harbour has been the summer holiday choice for generations of South Australians. Victor Harbour offers just about everything you could want for a relaxing holiday, with sun, sand and surf, clear turquoise waters, stunning views, outstanding early colonial architecture and good pubs and cafes and restaurants. It's easy to understand why you'd want to go there. There's even a Clydesdale horse-drawn tram journeying your 600 metres across the causeway to Granite Island, where you can meet the resident little penguins. Well, time for a sit down and relax at the motel before tea. Yes, you guessed it, a few stubbies as well. Bit of fun and frivolity before we have to head out for some tea. G'day everybody! Hey! We're out and about today. Hey, have a look at this. Have a look at our beautiful surroundings. Look at this. Look at this. And this way, mm -hmm. this way, this way. Sun's going down there in the distance, isn't it? And I'll turn you back around so you can see us. We've got stubbies. We're down on the beach. We're being romantic. It's a romantic night tonight. Yep. Old Rusty looked at a couple of Harleys today and fell in love. So now he's sweetening me up. Ha! You've got to do these things while you're on the road. But, jokes aside, jokes aside, we had a fantastic ride today. We come down from... Manum. Wentworth? Manum? Manum? Manum. 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 Yeah, we where come... did you think where we were from? Yeah. <laughs> and I'll tell you, that was absolutely beautiful. Mm. And the ride down from Manum down to Victor Harbour. Oh, we went to Adelaide first up, went to a couple of Harley shops. Yep. Just to have a look around. And then we headed out to Victor Harbour. But we went around the... Um, Cape Jarvis. Yeah, around Cape Jarvis and all that. It's the scenic way, the Fluo way. Fluo, isn't it? Yeah, something like that. We'll put it on there. You're supposed to put a little spin on it. It's, it's like French. French. But anyway, we went around that way. And I'm telling you, if you haven't been over to South Australia, get your fucking ass in the gear, yeah. pull your finger and get over here. Yeah. I'll tell you what, especially if you've got bikes, because it's absolutely beautiful ride. And we had a ball of a time today. And now we're going to finish it off. We're going to see that sun there. We're going to sit here, drink a couple of stubbies. Watch the sun go down. And watch the sun go down. Then we're going back to the room and have more stubbies, aren't we? As we can. Yeah. Victorian weather finally is starting to clear up a little bit. Yep. Probably fucking Tasmania too, but we don't give a stuff about that just we're yet, do we? Because we're heading towards Victoria. Mount Gambia probably tomorrow night. And then later in the week, what are we doing? Oh. I'm meeting me brother! Dinah Madness. From another mother. Dinah <laughs> <laughs> Madness adventure. And Amanda too, of course. Yes, yes his lovely wife. Yep. Wife? Well, you might as well say that. Yeah, you might as well say that. He's fucking that end peck. It's not funny That's anyway. Right. He's that far under the thumb. It's not funny, isn't yeah. it, babe? That's it. Mm. Mm -hmm. But we haven't got long. The sun's going down, guys. We're going to get going. Over the hill. Over the hill. I might even take a couple of pictures of it for you mm -hmm. and show you but absolutely beautiful. It's still about 26 degrees here. Victor Harbour, remember that? The Fluro Way, the Fernay Way? Fernay, Fernay Way. Whatever it is, come that way. We've never been that way before. Beautiful, absolutely glorious. Someone told us to go that way. Yes, yeah, I've told us a few years ago actually, but we never ever went, but we've done it now. Yep. Oh mate, mate, you just got to come here. You have to come here and see this. Look at this, up behind old, no halo there, you know, because she's no angel. <laughs> she's my angel, but she's no other one else's angel. But look at that, will you? Mate, you've got to come and get your ass down here. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Look at it. Look at it. Beach the look sunset. at this. It's amazing. Look at this. Look at that, will you? Yep. Kimmy Russ Adventures. Gone all out. Gone all out tonight. That's Granite Island. Granite Island. Yep. Over there. Absolutely beautiful. There we go, guys. Just come here. Yeah, come here. Look at it. You're not going to miss the sunset because I'm not going to let you. Mate, you're missing it. Where are you? Look at it. Look at it. And you should be here. There it is there. Look at that. Look, 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 look. You should be here with us. Yeah. Come on now, guys. It's almost gone, guys. It's almost gone. 
Come on, guys, look, get down here, get down here. We'll be here for the next, what, I don't know, 10 hours or so? 12 hours or so. 12. Yeah. <laughs> then we're out yeah, of here. We're out of here. Hey, right, guys, catch you later. Bye. Must be a bit of romance or something coming in this holiday. I better look out because we've caught a couple of sunsets now. But this one was absolutely beautiful and spectacular. As the sun was going down over the back of Granite Island there, absolutely splendorous.